after announcing the judgment of God, Elijah turned and walked away. Elijah knew that if he was found, then he would get killed. So he went into the wilderness and he hid himself near a stream. What was his name? I'll send soldiers to catch that old fool. We will let the people watch as he's been sacrificed to Baal. Ha! I... I don't think we can find him. Nobody knows where he comes and where he goes. Listen to me, dear. I think it's better for us to repent and turn to the God of Israel. Never! There will be no God but Baal. I will find that old man, even if he's hiding under the earth. I will find him and kill him. Ha! Huh. Jezebel sent her soldiers everywhere in search of Elijah, but nobody could find him. In the meantime, just like God told Ahab, a severe drought came over the land. Trees and plants dried up. But God took care of Elijah. He drank water from the stream. And crows brought him bread. Praise and glory to the Lord, who provides me with bread and water. How long, my Lord? How long? Poor people are starving to death. The blood of your faithful servants is flooding Baal's altar. Why are you silent, my lord? Elijah. Huh? Yes, my lord. You must go to Sarapta in Sidon. There, a widow will give you food. The stream is going to dry up. Yes, my lord. I will. Heeding God's words, Elijah left the forest and left for Sarapta. He walked for many days without food and water. And finally, he arrived at the village of Sarapta. Is this the village of Sarapta? Yes. Who are you? You look tired. I have been walking for many days. Can you, can you please give me a morsel of bread and some water to drink, please? Mm. I... All we have is flour left for just one bread and little oil. I I was going to bake it and eat it with my son before we die. Don't worry. Go home and make food for you and your son. But first, make a small loaf of bread for me and bring it to me. The Lord has told me that if you do this, your jar will never go empty and the jug of oil will never go dry. Huh? I will come back in a while then. So the old woman went home and did as Elijah told her. The jar was refilled with flour and the jug never ran out of oil. Huh? But it's a miracle! God worked a miracle for them and they never ran out of food for many days. The bin of flour was never used up nor did the jug of oil. Elijah lived with them as long as the drought lasted, but one day... No! My son! What happened? Why are you crying? My son... He... He... What happened? Tell me! He... He died today. He was sick for many days. Huh? Hmm. Do not worry. Your son will live. Let me go to him. Lord, my God, 
hear your servant's prayer. You are the refuge of the poor and the father of the orphans. Let this child live again. The Lord heard Elijah's prayers. The soul of the child came back to him and he was alive again. Huh? What happened? Life. My son, mother, my son, you are back. Thank you, God. Thank you. Now I know that the word of the Lord in your mouth is the truth. <laughs>